And I can empathize with the person asking the question because oftentimes I will see a report on the, the local news and the meteorologist will hype some global warming connection to you know, a weather event that's occurred uh, since recorded history. To every um, severe weather and, and, and so I understand where it can seem like they're always pushing it. But here's something that's, that's interesting and I think very important for people to understand. The American Meteorological Society is the only body, the only science body in the United States, or excuse me, in the world, the only science body in the world whose full membership has been polled on climate change issues. And we talk about consensus. When the question is asked of the American Meteorological Society, has the planet warmed in the past century? They overwhelmingly say yes, as do virtually all climate realists. We presented that data ourselves. During the past century, yes, temperatures have warmed. Next question, have humans played some role? Well, according to AMS members, the vast majority say yes, humans are playing some role, as do virtually all climate realists. And it's on those two meaningless questions that we're told there's a vast majority, the 97% consensus, because they're only asking those two questions which mean nothing because that's not in dispute. But when the AMS, when the full body, the only body to be asked these questions was asked how concerned about human-caused cl uh, climate change are you, the number was just over 30%. That's the question that counts. And if you want to say there's a consensus, and instead of talking about facts, talk about a show of hands, the consensus is that we're not creating a climate crisis. That's what counts. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and consider donating to the Heartland Institute to support more vibrant free markets, greater individual liberties, and more videos like this one.